Hi everybody, welcome to my art journal. My name is Sarah and I'm the artist Ben Pinsel Geschichten talking to you here while working on my newest art journal page. The background story or the reason, the story that made me make this page will be up on my blog on Friday this week. As per usual, there is a whole big blog post about all the art stuff that I published this week. So I'm gonna focus on the technical things in this video. At least when it comes to talking, right? So I started with uh, choosing two pattern papers. I wanna do have kind of like, well, a vintage look, but not with vintage colors. So no browns per se. And I decided my color scheme would be black, white and phthalo green, which is this cold green that you can also see in the pattern paper. And then I did uh, find this plane uh, here that is kind of like um, a sketch when it comes to designing things. It's that kind of a style on the pattern paper. So I had to choose it because the uh, name of the page is Create It All. So uh, once I had my background pattern paper glued down and that plain positioned, not glued down yet, I did sketch out a typewriter. And uh, I'm gonna go with acrylics, titanium white and phthalo green on top and paint uh, the typewriter on this page here. This is pretty much the focal point, um, though there's other uh, patterns and, and things that I'm gonna use that might take a bit away from the focal point when it comes to interest on the page. But uh, this color blob here in form of a typewriter is prominent and significant enough on the page to be the focal point. So I'm just mixing phthalo green and titanium white just to have different kinds of shades in uh, the typewriter, to have lighter sections, darker sections, and then I'm going uh, as the last thing going on top of the lower section, just starting all of the keys on the typewriter. Now for the background, I had to tone down the pattern paper a bit, but not to the point that I said I couldn't see the pattern anymore because then why would I have put pattern paper there? So I'm going very lightly uh, over the top with uh, titanium white and then I'm stenciling the wood pattern there. <coughs> Excuse me. But before I do that, uh, I had to dry off my page a bit. And then I'm going in with mostly phthalo green, but a bit of white towards the top. And I'm just stenciling uh, in this uh, wood grain here to, um, well, have a bit of an interest again on the page. I have to make sure that I'm not going over the typewriter, just around it. So that's why I like to work with uh, sponge and acrylics here instead of uh, spray paints, which would have worked as well but then I would have to have had to work in another way around meaning painting the typewriter on top of the wood pattern. Again giving it a blast with my hair dryer, very sturdy one and then I'm going uh, around the typewriter mostly but also around the page just to have some darker sections like the quote-unquote dirty sections, the, the, the part that makes this Pay, uh, th this image look um, kind of vintage and antique, so to say, and just a bit rustic and grungy. Uh, I like to do that with charcoal when I work with acrylics. So it's it's pretty much the same um, technique that I also use with, uh, let's say, if I work with watercolors and I have colored pencils on top, it does the same thing. But for acrylics, I do prefer pastels or in this case charcoal because I like the black. So then I did glue down my little plane here and uh, just uh, went over the whole thing with uh, charcoal as well just to well bring it into the page and just connect it. And then I gave the whole page a uh, solid layer of fixative spray so that the charcoal settles and uh, letting that dry and then going only in with a black marker pen to uh, redefine some of the lines on the plane and uh, writing down 
my name of the page here. And that's that. That's my page of you. Again, want to know why I did make this page? Hop on over on Friday onto my blog. Until then, I will see you tomorrow with a new Tiny Tuesday and next Monday with a new art journal. Have a lovely, lovely day. Do all the good YouTube stuff. Like, share, subscribe. And uh, go create something and have fun with it, everybody. Bye-bye. Thanks for watching.